Hello and welcome to this video on how to retrieve your feedback and grade from a Turnitin Dropbox. Once inside the Moodle unit, navigate to the Turnitin Dropbox and select it. From within My Submissions, click the blue pen on the grade column and it'll load the Turnitin Document Viewer. The Feedback Studio environment will load and show you both the originality and grade mark reports overlaid on the paper. You can unselect the similarity layer and it will disappear. Within the grade mark layer you will see inline comments that have been left, as well as bubble text comments and predefined comments that academics might use. To view the predefined or quick mark comments or bubble text comments just click on the icon and it will load. If there has been a web link left you may click it and it will navigate directly within your browser to that web link leaving the feedback studio as another tab. Again clicking on the new comment there brought up the text around it. New comment with a bubble shows that the academic has left extra information around that. You navigate through the paper clicking on the comments you wish to read and find out what the academic has put. An academic can also do strike throughs if text is unnecessary or highlight a paragraph of text and add bubble comments or predefined comments and extra comments as you can see there where the predefined comment is at the top and more text is the additional information the academic may have written. Continue through the paper, digesting all the feedback that the academic has left. You can hide the feedback layer, but to bring it back you must click the bubble icon and bring back the instructor feedback column on the right. Some academics may leave a voice comment and you are able to listen to that by just clicking the play and stopping it with the pause button. The text comment below that is where the academic may leave the overall and general feedback towards the document. You're also able to download the current view of this paper, your digital receipt and your originally submitted file. When viewing the current view paper and download it as a PDF, it will download your submission with all the annotated text over the top. You'll notice that the bubble comments are numbered, allowing you to look at them at the bottom of the paper. Again read through the entire paper, scrolling to the bottom to find the information of final grade, general instructor feedback and then any numbered comments and web links that were left by the academic. As you scroll through the final section you'll notice that it has all the numbered pages and all the comments that are found on each individual page. When you've finished with a document you may close it down. Back in Feedback Studio the last option is just the general information about your paper with your submission ID, the last time it was graded, as well as your submission date. When you're finished close that and your Turnitin viewer will update within your Moodle environment. Thank you very much for watching this particular video.